So back in the day, this is what happened to me. Okay. So when I was younger, I had I, I had a best friend. I, I, she was she was totally my best friend. We grew up together and we were tight and everything. And then as we got older, we drifted apart. And then okay. she started hanging out with a certain type of group of girls that that kind of egged her on to go one direction. I went the other direction. We became enemies, mm. right? So we weren't cool. And then I started hearing her talk about my family. And that got really she weird. She tried. Uh oh. Right. And that hurt me because she knew inner things about my family. So that really hurt. So I, at the time, there's a time in your junior high life where you were, for me, where you mouth off, but you don't realize the repercussions that can happen if you uh -huh. kind of just go off too much. Mm -hmm. And you guys know I ask junior a lot of questions high, and I say a lot of high stuff. High school for me yeah. and college, go ahead. Oh, really? Okay, well, it now. took, took okay. junior high for me to go off and I was like, well, I could take her, I don't care. Like, she can talk all that smack, I don't care, I could take her any day. Well, it came back to me and she wanted to beat me up. She said, I want to meet you after school and I want to kick your butt because I'm sick and tired of you talking smack about me. Uh oh, what happened? I got so scared. I went home, fifth period, I went home and I just chilled. I remember it was like 4.30, <laughs> I was 4.30, yep, I ditched the whole fight and she came to my house and she was ringing my doorbell. Oh, she my, came to your house? She came to my house. Oh, girl. My mom came out and she looked out the window and she said, why is Michelle out there with all the friends? She oh brought no. Friends. She brought a crew with her. So girl. this is the first time you guys I heard of that term of getting jumped. Yeah. Like, I couldn't believe like she came to my house about to do this. So then I got really scared. And you know how a mom knows that look on your face? Mm -hmm. She gave one look to my face and she said, you did this, you start this, you finish it. Get up, no! we go. Yeah. I couldn't believe it. Mama Mai. So long story mama short. Mama Mai, mama Mai don't play. I know, I with the neighbors. There's a point to the story. So my mom, she encouraged me, she got me up on the couch, she got me into the backyard, told Michelle, come here, you come to my house, you come here, take off your shoes, and then put them back on in the back. <laughs> so we went in the backyard, I did get into my first fight. You beat her up barefoot, is that what you did? Your mother was the promoter? So she was she did. Freak. She did. She was a wreck. She let us go at it, and then she stopped us, she pulled us apart, yeah. and she said, now how you feel? Do you still hate each other? And, I, and we both said, yeah. Uh -huh. And she said, you see, I teach you fighting. Don't do anything to you. <laughs> but you learn you stand up for yourself. Aww.